Cool. Uh, love the graphics, first of all. And secondly, I have no idea what this game is. <gasps> Not that low data. New game. Yeah, I have no idea what this game is. I've never heard of it before. Uh, but I love that From night, Soft. Kane Morgan was lost in the dreams of his childhood. He saw the charred remains of his home. He saw himself standing alone amid the wreckage. His mother and father were nowhere to be found. Kane was very young at the time. So young that he didn't really understand that he lived in a country known as Solskia, and that the neighboring country, Aldine, had suddenly become a cruel, aggressive invader. There was one other thing. They had all left for the island. That was all he was able to remember. Hmm. Hungaria was the largest country in the western continent. The elders, who at the time were the acting rulers, had abruptly dispatched a group of knights to a place known as the Island of No Return. The young king, a man called Ian, who was known for his fairness and moderate manner, inquired with the elders as to the meaning of such a dispatch, but the elders didn't bother to reply. Gillian Morgan, the loyal leader of the king's retinue, was concerned about Ian, so he decided he would learn for himself what the elders were up to. He had but one piece of evidence to guide him. It was a vague utterance made by one of the elders. Somewhere on the island of no return was a ring imbued with eternal power. It was not a time for indecision. Gillian proposed to the king that his own son, Cain, should journey to this island. A few days later, before daybreak, a small boat departed from the port of Hengaria. It was a boat secretly obtained by Gillian for one purpose only, to carry his son, Cain, holding in his hand a sealed scroll from King Ian to the island of no return. All right, bit of a lore dump there. Yeah, uh, so one of my favorite games of all time, my favorite series of all time, is King's Field. So I'm hoping this is like it. Got a little bit more story here. Man, them graphics. Confusing choice in character accents is just the best. Uh oh. Fisherman's gonna have a bad day. Now, is that necessary? Ah! Oh no. Ripping pepperoncinis. Apparently, this is a bad island to visit. Okay, yes. Oh my gosh, it controls exactly like Kingsfield. I'm already. Oh, amazing. 
Okay, so I take it I can't go back out? Let me just quick save real quick, just uh, before I mess around here. Oh yeah, that works. Oh, no you don't. Finding that there's a million of them. They're coming at me. Oh, man. Man, I want to kill him, but I keep backing out, so let's just see what's ahead. Maybe I can get through when I do a little more damage. I'm moving faster than, uh, than Kingsfield, to be sure. This is more like Kingsfield 1 speed. Hello? What's this? Oh, it's a, it's a memory card. Oh, that's very generous of them. So might as well use the in-game saves. I wonder if there's any stuff hidden in the walls like crazy like there is in Kingsfield. So this is more of an anime setup for sure. Uh, okay, should I jump down? If I jump down, I'm not getting back, so maybe we'll try and... Oh, look, there is a way down. Let's go this way. Hello? I hope everything's friendly here. That must be a friend! Hello! Oh. What did you just say to me? Did you just say Warcraft Dragon noise to me? Oh dear me. You moved pretty good. Yeah, take that, nerd. Golden grass, I take it that's probably the healing item. Alright, let's go at this. Come on. How about ye? Hmm. Jumpy boys. This is like the, um. Ugh. The, uh. The elementals. Oh, jeez. Okay, you first. Yeah. Come here. I'm gonna mess around now. Get God. Looks like he dropped something. Oh, he definitely did. He did too. What is that? Mystery or uh, mystery gem? Sagan's Thorn. I do love random fantasy game items. Lottery gem. I have a feeling there won't be crafting. What's that? Also, I seem to be. Oh yeah, I'm in running automatically. I wonder if there's a time where I'll have to choose to walk. Hmm. So, a lot like Sphinxfield, but a little bit different mechanically. There's a dragonfly coming at me. That's usually a good sign. Come on over here and don't shoot. Got a stinger for sure. Yeah, this is like a... I wonder if this came before the Ancient City, because it's got like a... <coughs> Kingsfield 2, American 2, vibes, uh, not, not quite as refined feeling as the ancient city, or not as, as gritty and deadly feeling. Good though, that's good, I'm enjoying it, this, this is, this is good, this is controls well. Oh man, it really is like fighting the elementals, which is great, because they were one of my favorite enemies. Come on, you. Have a day. Man, this is jumpy. Man. There we go. I gotcha. I gotcha. A leaf gem. I thought it said loaf. A loaf gem. Ooh. That thing is definitely moving around. Oh, it's shooting at me, dude. You're not a friendly flower, to be sure. I'm not sure if I can go in the water, but it kind of looks like I maybe can't. So... But I don't know why they would throw a thing at me. You know, it's so early in the game. Oh, yep, water is, is deadly. <laughs> Turns out. Okay, good to know. Okay, new plan is to run this way. Woo! There we go. Okay, now we can get him. Avanti. This one has a much more anime feel, which is definitely interesting. Is there a charge bar? <clears throat> no, it doesn't seem like there's a charge bar. It's just like an attack speed, essentially. Phew! Okay, next. I think 
at these guys are actually kind of worth the kill. I wonder if they respawn every time I go out. Because that might be a good spot to train, if so. Man, I love that you get a rapier first off, because that was like my go-to weapon. So where's that guy's ship? It's very sad that the king, uh, king's son doesn't know how to swim. It's very sad. Very sad state of the kingdom. Alright, so I can't go this way, can I? I can't actually. Typical Kingsfield 2 BS. There's a back door. Alright, what's this? Hmm. Man, love the graphics. Love it. I just feel like PS2 games, the grittiness, although it's not hyper realistic, it first of all look, just, just looks, looks cool. It looks like somebody made it. And second of all, you can kind of define the walls and areas where you're going a little easier than when everything is super realistic. Okay, seals. We can't do that yet, whatever that is. No clues as to what it does. Yeah, so I just feel like PS2 really was the peak era for graphics because it's realistic enough. <clears throat> Although, you know, some games had way better cinematics. Sure, I'll give you that. Oh my gosh, it's getting dark. It's actually getting dark. So what does that mean, if it's getting dark? Also, my man got eaten by a dragon, and it wasn't dark. So, what's with that? Also, there's no, no sign of him out here, which is pretty impressive. Dragon just took the entire, uh, entire boat with him. What's this area? Let's go this way first. Oh wait, yeah, that's the safe spot. Yep, 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 yep. We knew that. So we'll head back out this way. And fight some more dudes. Alright, so do not look at the plant, whatever you do. It didn't start attacking me until I kind of like got right on top of it. Do not look at the flower. There's nothing here that is nice. Nothing. On the lonely island, whatever it's called. One, I leveled up. And another one. I'm better at this. Oop. Mm, man. That's the only problem with the rapier, is it does a lot of damage. Or at least it, it usually. It's usually a later game item in King's Field. Uh, but it's such a precise attack. Alright, so the only thing I have to say about this type of graphics is uh, little things on the floor do blend in pretty good. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a path going up. Let's do this one. Oh, okay, here's the top of the waterfall. So that'll be the flower down there. Alright. Must be the healing items, I'm gonna assume. I'll just keep an eye out for that bug, make sure he doesn't poke me in the face. Oh, there's a broken bridge. That's a shame. It's a real shame. I wonder if we can convince a man who never stops eating chicken. Oh, a new area? Uh, to fix the bridge. Or do we get a cutscene? Oh, hey, look, a town. Hey, cool. Nice. I'm gonna have to read a little bit more about this game and figure out which one came first. It looks like this is the older one. It's interesting that they would uh, make like a side game that is so much like Kingsfield, but not call it Kingsfield. Hello? Hello? Are you dead? Your box? No. Is it power old? Weird cutscene going through the doors. Hi. Can I speak to you? 
are you speakable to? No, I guess not. I'm hitting I'm hitting the X button. So, hmm. Oh there yeah. What is it? What is it? I'm sleepy. I'm eepy. Talk to me later. Okay, I will talk to you later when you're not so eepy. I was feeling eepy earlier today, but now I am not. Is this open? It does open. Nice hammock. Who are you? What's in the box? What are you looking at? What a weird so, face. So, you're the new guy from the mainland, right? Are you related to the fisherman? <laughs> Welcome to this miserable island. <laughs> <laughs> So, you're the new guy. What? Yeah? The king wants you to retrieve the eternal power? Yeah. <laughs> hey, sorry. I'm a nosy person. I won't tell the captain. The Why don't so weird. you visit the shrine? There might be something of interest there. But that's only if you can open the water gate. Hmm. This is kind of cool. This really feels more adventurous than Kingsfield. Like, Kingsfield, I love because it feels like you're completely alone. Death is around every corner. Whereas this feels like... Hey, how are you doing? How are you doing, man? And how is your thing in the box doing? <laughs> but this feels like... This is like edgy dragon quest. <laughs> I'm into it. This is cool so far. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm actually going to really enjoy this. I mean, I knew I was going to enjoy this, but this is already not what I was expecting. So, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to end it here, and, uh, we'll see if we can train a little bit and kind of get a grip on this in, in the next episode and figure out how it really works. Hopefully it, you can train, because I really like games so just grind for hours. Um, but anyway, yeah, thanks for taking a look at uh, a first look at Eternal Ring with me, another game from FromSoft, and yeah, it should be pretty fun to play through, so have a great week, and bye!